You don't want to miss this. Things are about to get real. Hey guys, so this is gonna be, whether I like it or not, my last episode that I play of Life is Strange for today because I've played a lot today, but I also have some stuff to do, so yeah, let's, let's go in. Okay, Drew's room. Hey! You made it. Oh. Hey, Chloe. Hey, Drew. How's your knee? How's your knee doing? Do they think it's gonna heal? Uh, I'm not sure, actually. It's too early to tell. Sorry to hear it. It's, it's all good. <laughs> Love the hair, by the way. Pretty cool. Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> just uh, trying it out. Sometimes you've just got to do something new. Mm -hmm. Hey, any news about Rachel? Her mom seemed hopeful. Ow. Rachel's stable. My elbow just She'll popped. She'll probably wake up soon. How she get hurt? You'll think I'm joking when I tell you, but I'm not. What happened? She got stabbed in the arm by Damon fucking Merrick. Seriously? It, it wasn't because of me, was it? No, not at all. If anything, I should have thought about what happened to you before getting Rachel involved. That's crazy. Fuck that guy. I wish I could get my hands on him. Drew, chill out, okay? Uh, I'm headed out. Everything okay in here? Yep. Yeah. Don't want to have too much money now. Try to keep it appropriate for the hospital. Bye, Dad. See you, Pops. Man. Maybe... I shouldn't have mentioned Damon. Rachel's gonna be up soon. Should probably head over when I'm ready. Okay, I just... I am too worried about Rachel at the moment, All right. so... I'm gonna head out. It was really great to see you, Chloe. Agreed. Don't be a stranger, okay? Yeah. Tell Rachel we're rooting for her. You bet. All right. Chloe, this is Mr. Amber. Rachel is waking up now. I'm sure she'd love to see you. Chloe, run. Run, run. Chloe. Run, Chloe. Is this Rachel's room? No. Is this Rachel's room? Yeah. It's cool. Come on, game. Come on. Come on. Game. Thank you. Oh my god. Uh, I'm glad that you're here. Me too, Aww. Rachel. She looks so bad. It really hurts. The pain will pass. Aww. Chloe's here. You want me to stay? No. I'll be okay. Thanks, Dad. I'll come back. so bad for her. <laughs> My guardian angel. How are you? How are you? 
Not great. Better with you here. No. Rachel. I'm sorry. No. What? What for? <laughs> You're here because of me. Because I choked back there in the junkyard. What? Shut up. You were so fierce and I, I just froze. I fucked it up. I'm so sorry. And you saved my life. You saved my life. I almost lost you. I almost lost you. I can't believe I almost- You're not getting rid of me that easy. No. Good. Happy that your dad's here. I mean... I'm still mad at him. For everything he's done. But... It felt so good to lean on him. He's my dad, you know? I felt completely safe. Like, on Mount Hood. <laughs> Would you do something for me? Anything. Sarah. Mom. <laughs> it's so weird to say. I'm not even sure what she is, honestly. But <laughs> I think I still want to meet her. Aww. I figured you would. I don't even know if she's still in Arcadia Bay. But if she is, will you find her, please? Yes. You really want this, don't you? I do, Chloe. I really do. Then, of course, whatever it takes, I bet my dad has her number, maybe in his office, our house keys just under the mat. The code is 0722. I'm gonna forget that. To your, your dad's office? 0722. It's her birthday. Yeah. My birthday. I figured. I'll find her, Rachel. And then I'll... I'll tell her how fucking cool you are. No. <laughs> Thank you, Chloe. For... Yeah. Everything. Yeah. Yeah. I like it. It's, uh, it's nice. A nice balloon, I guess. <laughs> yeah. 
It's for Drew. Were you, were you just in there? I'm actually here for Rachel. What? Rachel's here? What happened? Um, she got stabbed by a psycho. Oh my god. Yeah. It was insane. Holy shit. Are you okay? Uh, I'm fine. She's fine too, by the way. Are you, are you two in some kind of trouble? You can tell me if you are, you know. I won't judge. Um... Nothing we can't handle. Nothing we can't handle. Chloe. I'm seriously worried about you. Well, don't be. Uh, I mean, you're hanging out with Rachel Amber a lot lately. So, right? So what? So, obviously, something is going on. It's none of your business. It's really... It's really not your business, Elliot. Okay. That's fair. Just remember I'm here, okay? If you suddenly need something. Thanks. Anyway. See you around. Yeah. See you around, Chloe. gonna like follow us or something isn't he Hello? Who do you think's gonna be there, Chloe? Glad she remembered that. So I didn't have to. Search this office for any communication with Sarah that can help me find her. I'm not gonna be able to smash my way through this one. Hopefully there's a key around somewhere. Dang it. James sure keeps lots of files on people. Even if James is trying to protect Rachel from her mother, this seems like a pretty terrible way to act. I guess getting your ass kissed comes with the DA territory. Sheldon, why do 
I feel like I've heard that name before? Best dad? <laughs> that stuff is all politics anyway. Oh, hmm. he. Found you. Yes. Mikey. Hey, Chloe, thanks for visiting again. Or thanks again for visiting. Drew says good luck out there. Thanks, good luck to him too. Chloe? Yeah? You're, or you're stronger than anything. Hope so. Okay, um, new page. Max. I don't, or I don't think you can know how you feel about someone until you almost lose them. Until you sit in a hospital waiting room, frozen in a place yet somehow falling, or falling silently, desperately, pleading to hear their voice, touch their hand, and make them laugh. Then you know. It was weird being with Rachel's dad, and actually kind of nice. We were on the same team. Suddenly, and... None of this other crap mattered. I can see why Rachel loves him. Gotta check in, or got it. That got to check in on uh, Drew. Spend time, or spend some time with Mikey. Gotta say that family is actually pretty amazing. After what felt like forever, Rachel woke up. Even with everything that's happened, she's still focusing on finding her mother. So am I too. Here's the plan. I'm going to dig around in James's office and find whatever I or, and find whatever I can about her and track her down so that they can meet. I don't care how tough it may, or it might be. Chloe the bounty hunter. James has a file on Frank. Oh god. I'd love to read this, but I've got to focus on finding Rachel's mom. If it can rain ash, I Yes, it could snow in LA. She's so violent. <laughs> it's the big one. Oh my god. Arcadia Bay's least wanted. some of those files laying around. Why? Welcome to Shadyville. never gave them to Rachel? That's so messed up. So my Rachel, my name is Sarah and I'm your biological mother. The first thing you should know about me is that giving you up was the worst mistake I've ever made. I was struggling or, or with something at the time, something I've been battling with ever since. The battle has taken everything from me, mostly import or most importantly, you. But now I'm in a place where I know I can be part of your life. It's more than I deserve, I know, but I would love to try, or I would love to try if you want to. Please take your time and if you need, or if you have anything to say or any questions, hearing from you would mean the world. I love you very much and I hope to meet you soon. Love, Sarah. That's so sad. 
Dearest Rachel, I hope it's alright for me to write to you again. I haven't heard from you yet, and that's okay. It really is. I just don't, or I just feel like I have so much to catch up on, you know? I don't remember much of my life, or I don't remember much of my life. It's a symptom of the choices I've made. So much is lost, except you. I remember everything about you. The crinkle of your nose, the depths of your eyes, the knowing smile that somehow made it seem like you've seen it all before. I can call it up whenever I want, as clear as a summer day. I was so afraid, afraid that I was, or that I would be a terrible mother to you, that I would, or that I would screw you up the way I know, or the way I screwed up so much of my life. Now I know, of course, that my fear was wrong. Far worse than being a bad mother is never know or never knowing what kind of mother I would have been. I'm sorry that, or if you can find the courage to forgive me, maybe we can start over. I want to with all my might. I want to. Love, Sarah. Beautiful Rachel, I read, or I read somewhere maybe a fortune cookie. I read somewhere maybe a, for, a fortune cookie that you can never stop in the same river twice because after it moves, it's not really the same river anymore. It's something new. Do you think that's true? I try to picture you reading these letters and I wonder what your reactions are, how I might seem to you. This is, this is mysterious, what? might seem to you this is or this mysterious mother i don't blame you for not writing back i just all right i can't talk <laughs> i don't blame you for not writing back you will write when you're ready i imagine your dad is still wary of these um that's okay james is protective of you just as i would be but there but he's also kind and compassionate per or, but he's also a kind and compassionate person that was the problem, really. I wasn't cut out for him, or the life he wanted to give for you. I knew it then, even when he didn't. I knew we could never have the same relationship we should have had, but I hope we can have something new together. I hope it so much. All my love, Sarah. Sarah, in this letter, doesn't seem anything at all like the person James told us about last night. James, I understand your reluctance to, to, that, to let me speak to Rachel, but don't you think the decision should belong to her? Everything I've done over the past year is to, or has been to prove you that I'm ready to be in Rachel's life. I know I've gone through rehab, I'm, or, yeah, I know I've gone through rehab, I'm in recovery, and I am no longer in need of money or assistance. I know I can be a positive influence on her. I'm coming to Arcadia Bay in hopes that we can at least meet to discuss this. So you can see how my, or so you can see how much I've changed. If you still have any feelings left for me at all, you'll give me a fair chance to prove myself to you, and hopefully to Rachel too. You are the only love of my life, once. Please don't take this away from me, Sarah. Dear Mr. Amber, I represent Sarah Gear 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 Hard Hardens, <laughs> lawful mother of Rachel Amber. Okay. Um, she wants partial custody of Rachel. Is pretty much where that's getting at. So. This looks like Sarah stopped cashing the checks James sent her. Uh, Guess he forgot to mention that during his story last night. Wow. I have to know who James is talking to on the secret phone of his. It could be about Sarah. I'm told you can help me with my problem. Crossing the line, eh? Let's talk. 
Will call tonight. I found out who you were looking for. Call you in 15. Well, this isn't chair. This isn't a charity. I'm gonna need you, or I'm gonna need you to do what we talked about. I can't. Sure you can, because I talked to your girl and she has a big mouth. Turns out she's not so easy. We're going to need to be more hands-on. Don't hurt her. Relax, I've got my best guy on it. How's your daughter? You know she attacked me first, right? You really shouldn't teach her, or you really should teach her to behave better. Nothing? Guess we don't need this to take, or guess we, guess you don't need this taken care of anymore. So that is Damon. This is working with Damon Merrick? Nice. This is insane. What were they talking about? Is the girl Damon's talking about Sarah? <sighs> Whatever is going on, I need to see if Damon knows where Sarah is. But how do I get him to tell me? Um... Where is Sarah? So, we're using names now. Relax, man. It's simple. Either you do what I want or your little problem becomes a big problem. Now, did you take care of the evidence or not? Shit. What do I say? I did. I know you're new to this, but here's how it works. You show me proof, I give you what you want. Hope James actually has this evidence. Don't think Damon will tell me where Sarah is. Unless I send him a picture. James sure keeps lots of files on people. Sheldon. Why do I feel like I've heard that name before? James has a file on Frank. I'd love to read this, but I've got to focus on finding Rachel's mom. Arcadia Bay's least wanted. Shit. Which of these is Damon talking about? I could just take a wild guess and see what he says. Or... Maybe there's some info on the case hanging around the office. Could this be the evidence? Damon and Knives seem like a solid bet. Did Damon really shoot someone? Guess I shouldn't be surprised. <sighs> if TV has taught me anything, these babies will be swimming in DNA. lots of files on people. Sheldon. Why do I feel like I've heard that name before? James has a file on Frank. I'd love to read this, but I've got to focus on finding Rachel's mom. Where would that be? Arcadia Bay's least wanted. Name, Damon Merrick. Okay. Deadly weapon. After the verbal, okay. Fire poker hitting the victim several times in the head before fleeing the scene. Gloves. Okay, it's gloves. I'm waiting. What's the ev- er, that- 
What? That's the evidence, right? Yeah, and now you freaking destroy it. Why are you so bad at this? I'll get right on that. If I can figure out how. How do I destroy a glove? Maybe I can burn it somehow. Is that made out of wood? That looked like it was made out of wood. No, it's not. Chloe, you're gonna burn their house down. Do you not remember how this went with Rachel? you're destroying evidence might as well tell me which of my guys was the snitch no clue no one no more no one I checked or I checked with the a b p d there's no snitch bullcrap tell me who it is or maybe you'd rather deal with your problem yourself damn I hope James has something here to tell me who Damon's informant is. So I need to find which of Damon's guys has been snitching. I should search around the office to see if there's any info to help me out. Um, planning supper, what time do you think you'll be home? Don't wait for me. Sweetheart, we don't get enough family time as it is. Does Rachel want to join us? She's very welcome to. Mom, I'm sorry, I just can't make it tonight. Chloe, is everything okay? Yeah, everything's fine. Okay, love you. Love you too. Okay. Arcadia Bay's least wanted. No dip, Chloe. Okay. If I'm going to accuse one of these guys, I'd better be sure I'm right. Thunder headshot, uh, Vendor headshot, Frank headshot, or Sheldon headshot. Well, the only one in here that, like, you know, there's a folder for, or a thing for besides Frank is Sheldon. This is that freak from the mill. Wonder what Damon would think of his very cooperative comment. I agree to aid the courts on future cases. That could be seen as a little snitchy. Okay, there's no way that Frank is snitching on Damon. But I love learning about his badass loitering charge. I agree to aid the courts on future cases. That could be seen as a little snitchy. Feels a little weird having this guy's records at my fingertips. This is that freak from the mill. Wonder what Damon would think of his very cooperative comment. Yes, I'm lucky James keeps so much info at home. I agree to aid the courts on future cases. That could be seen as a little snitchy. Gerald Scott. I agree to aid the courts on future cases. That could be seen as a little snitchy. Gerald Scott. 
This guy let me into the mill. Cool, dude. I totally knew this guy was a criminal when I stole from him. Guess this explains why Mr. Amber knows so much about Frank. Could this douchebag be the snitch Damon's talking about? We never met. Good work. Guess all leaves leaves is our handoff. Show me that you've got my payment and I'll tell you where to meet. Payment? Fuck. Good, so me pick and or pick and we're all set. Here's hoping James already has demons money. <sighs> but where would it be? Crap. I guess getting your ass kissed comes with the DA territory. <laughs> um. Feels a little weird having this guy's records at my fingertips. I wonder if this has anything to do with Damon's stash. Here's your girl, ready to go. Fuck, that's Sarah. And she's at the mill. What is he doing to her? Aww. Bring me the package and we can finish the job. I'll be right there. On my way, don't do anything in the meantime. You really are new at this. Better hurry, this chick's starting to get on my nerves. Holy shit. Does James even know what he's doing? Okay, I still have time. Damon's waiting for his money, right? He wouldn't do anything to her. Yeah. I wouldn't like Fuck. doubt that. I need to get there fast. Chloe? Elliot? Oh my hey. god. Elliot, what are you doing here? What are you doing here? This is Rachel's house, right? Did he really just follow me here? I can't really talk about it. Rachel, Rachel needs my help. I'm sure she does. I'm more concerned about you. I'm fine. You're the one acting crazy. You shouldn't be here. Chloe. What is... Ugh. Are you stupid? Elliot, put that down. You have no idea what you're dealing with. And you do? Chloe, God, what have you gotten yourself into? You... You wouldn't understand. Give me a chance. What the hell are you doing? I can't tell you, but obviously this is pretty serious shit. That's why I need to leave right now. You mean serious for Rachel, right? But, but you're the one putting yourself in danger again. I'm so sick of you not seeing who Rachel really is. When will you realize what she's doing to you? Elliot, just take a step back. No. You need to listen to me. What has your relationship with her gotten you? You... You don't know what you're talking about. First night you hang out, what happens? 
you end up in a fight. You don't know what you're talking about. Rachel saved my ass. I'm sure that's how it seemed to you. Stop, stop suggesting that she's somehow bad The next day she convinces you to skip school. Magically, she barely gets in trouble. And you get expelled. I took the fall because I wanted to. Rachel tried to protect me. Yet somehow, it all worked out for her in the end, as usual. Oh my god, I You don't understand. You weren't there. Was she protecting you when she made you take part in a play you didn't want to be in? S seriously, man. You, you need to shut the fuck up before- I've been quiet long enough. Look, Rachel is an amazing actress. And I don't mean on stage. She's fake. You're real. And I hate to see her manipulate you like this. Elliot, I, I promise no one is manipulating me. No? Just look where you are now. A high school dropout. Hanging out with criminals and breaking into houses. It's crazy. It just as easily could have been you in that hospital today. If that ever happened. Stalker much? Dude, you, you know you sound a little stalkerish right now. <clears throat> Stalking is defined as repeated unwanted interactions. How long have my interactions been unwanted? Elliot. I'm the one who cares about you, Chloe. Me, not Rachel. It's time you saw the truth. What does that mean? It means you're going to stop thinking about Rachel and pay attention to me now, for once. What in the world? Look, I'm sorry, but I really need to go. Why did you make me do that? Can't you just listen to me? Elliot's gone full blown crazy. I, I need to get the police to come without tipping him off. Who was there for you? When Max left? When your dad died? Mm. No one else gave a shit about you except for me. We have a lot to talk about, and I don't care how long it takes. We're not leaving until you see that I'm right. Mm. All right, Elliot. You want to talk so bad? Let's talk. If you succeed in backtalk, listen to your opponent and choose, or to succeed in backtalk, listen to your opponent and choose a related combat or comeback. What's really going on here? You can tell me. Here's what's going on. We're at the DA's house, and we should probably leave before he comes back. Don't worry. With Rachel in the hospital, James isn't coming anytime soon. I'm talking about your situation. Rachel is dangerous. You need to realize that. You're right, Elliot. I didn't want to admit it before, but it's true. My life is in danger. Thank you, Chloe. All I want is to help you. I'm glad you can finally see that. You're right. I do need help. I need help immediately. Hey, it's okay. I'm not going anywhere. I feel trapped. Boxed in. 
I desperately want to leave this situation. It takes a lot of guts to tell me all this. And I want you to know that I will always be there for you, no matter what. It's the police. Okay, don't panic. Uh, I'm sure they'll just want to ask us why we're here. What do we do? I'll talk to them. Uh, shit, um, there's nothing to be concerned about. Thank you, Elliot. You're a great friend. That's really loud and it's annoying. Yes. Loser. <laughs> He's really stupid. <laughs> Surely he hasn't messed with Chloe Price yet. <laughs> scared me. Because Rachel got angry at her dad, who's been lying to her all her life, and he's still lying. Hey, being a dad's tough. Uh, that doesn't justify what he's done. I'm just saying, I'd probably do anything to keep you safe. Hey, Dad. Yeah. Did you ever lie to me? I don't mean telling me that ashtray I made for mom wasn't a piece of crap. I mean, like, really lied about something that might hurt me to know. What do you think? just don't know anymore. That's what makes it so horrible. James Amber, the perfect dad, and James Amber, the scheming asshole, would act exactly the same around Rachel. Oh, sweetheart, you're a terrible liar, so I couldn't have been much better, right? Would you love me less? Of course not. You sound pretty sure, sweetheart. You were pretty sure Mom would never fall in love with someone like David, too. Mm -hmm. Are you really ready to hear the answer to your question? Ready as I'll ever be. Problem is, I'm dead. So how am I supposed to tell you anything? Oh. Oh my god! I guess it's better this way, not knowing. 
then I'll always be the perfect dad. How many people get to say that?